Hiya, I am Husky Light. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for your likes, shares, subscribes, everything. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for your support. Um, I'm doing a real push on subscribing this week. If I can get up to 5,000, I'm stopping the adverts because I'm just as sick of them as you are. So please remember to subscribe, share this with your friends. Somebody might really need it this week. Um, right, into your reading. Also, if you like a reading, please just go up click on the link, go in, into my website, all different prices, all different readings. Um, I'll get you booked in. I would love to meet you and do one for you. So let's get on with your reading for this week. We are going from Monday the 28th of September through to Sunday the 4th of October. Um, and we are starting off with the Ace of Swords. And this is in your health position. So this week with the ace, the aces are all about new concepts and new things coming in. Um, you're going to find, for some of you, you're going to find it within yourself this week to stop any bad habits um, or to, to put the effort in to stop any bad habits that you may have. You're going to find the inspiration and the, the inner strength to do that this week. So whether it's overeating or um, smoking, whatever it is, uh, whatever bad habit you may have, you're going to be able um, to have the, the strength to stop it, to put it into action, um, to really think about this is it, this is enough, I've had enough of this, it's stopping. Um, it also can mean for some of you that you're finally going to start doing something that is really good for you, that's going to become a habit, doing that little bit more exercise every day doing a bit of yoga, doing a bit of meditation, doing something that is really healthy for you. You're going to have an extra couple of glasses of water every day where you don't normally. So it, it can work either way for you this week. Um, it might, it's going to be difficult if you're giving something up this week. You may have a little bit of frayed nerves as you're doing that, but you've got a the strength to do that. You've got the strength. You, you know that sometimes if you have to give some up, it's not easy. It's not going to be a breeze always. Um, but you are wanting to care for yourself this week. So you are going to do it and you're going to put up with the initial uh, being uncomfortable while it's happening and making that transition over to being much, much healthier. Um, so it's really good. Um, look after yourselves and love yourselves while you're going through the process. Right, we have got the, why have I got a big dirty mark on my thumb? Sorry. Uh, we are going through to the five of wands. Five of wands is in your career and your finance for this week. Um, could be a bit of competition within work this week. Um, but if you play your cards right, you can compete successfully and come out on top and all is fine. Um, play fair whatever this situation that could come up in a work situation for you. Um, play fair even if everybody else around you isn't, you know, maybe they're taking shortcuts, maybe, and they'll be found out about it. So do what you, you know, people who play dirty, um, they only win in the short term. They don't win in the long term. They get discovered, they get found out. Um, so it's never, ever permanent. Um, so know that if there is anything going on like that in the workplace, this week, um, you will com come out completely successful in that and that's fine. In your finances for this week, uh, your money might be a little bit tight. Um, don't worry, don't get stressed about it. Look at your financial situation calmly. Look at it almost dispassionately. Cut yourself off from it. Um, if you can't meet some of your obligations, this week immediately it doesn't mean that you're not going to be able to the week after it doesn't so don't stress about it don't worry about it just do what you can and be honest about the situation um, don't stress about it don't focus on it don't worry about it things are going to get financially better very soon um, likely in a matter of, of only a few weeks so don't worry about it if you're in that situation for the rest of you you know, you're toddling along nicely and everything's fine. Remember, this is a general reading, so it doesn't apply to every single Virgo. Um, our next card, the only way you can do that is to get a personal reading. We've got the Nine of Pentacles. This is your friends. 
and your family for this week. Um, it's a really nice card. It's a really uplifting card. So whatever else is going on, friends and family are looking good this week. Um, things are things are going well for you. You've got some good energy. You've got happiness. You've got harmony all within your friends and family. Um, even down right down to the boring stuff that you have to do. You're going to sail through it with an ease with a yep I'm getting on with it I'm doing it um, there isn't any real conflict at all within friends and family and you, things are looking up things are looking good and you're going to be happier and things are going to be a lot easier so just things are smoothing things, things are smoothing as you're going through the week with that um, you've got a great deal to be proud of as well within your friends and family this week and and hope and what you can be hopeful about as well so just expect the best to happen and it will do in your next position we have got the ten of cups ten of cups is in your spiritual so this is a really nice card as well um, live in the moment seize the day go for it you are radiating a really good energy this week you've got a good attitude your mind body and spirit is all in balance this week it's nice it's really really nice um, share the positive energy you've got with others share your attitudes even share some of your beliefs with others uh, what goes around comes around and there may be people around you at the moment um, some who will need your positive energy um, or they may come to you for a shoulder to cry on they're going to need you at some point this week so give out that positive energy and let them absorb it and help them to feel better it's all about shining your light this week um, and being your wonderful brilliant selves um, and everything will go fine and you'll get through and we're finishing off with the knight of pentacles knight of pentacles is all about messages coming through this is in your love situation um, make sure that you are being practical about committed love relationships we all know it's not wine and roses it's not all super duper always uh, things should be a lot easier this week with the other card we've had in friends and family because it means that you both have to have a willingness to work together to work as a team to move forward to get through any rough spots that are going on um, and to work on relationships and you're well aware of this week and your partner will will be well aware of it as well so it's all about just working through things working as a team together and getting through make sure that you are meeting your responsibilities in the best way that you can have a think about is there anywhere within your relationship that maybe you've neglected recently uh, you've not spent as much time communicating with your partner spending as much time with your partner um, maybe you had an argument three weeks ago <laughs> you've still not forgiven each other for that have a think about if there's anything like that going on <clears throat> and sort it out this week you're going to be a team you're going to be closer together by doing that so do that this week um, vary your routine if you're looking for somebody new you're not going to meet them the way you would normally meet somebody um, or how you're usually trying to do it to meet someone so try something different maybe go somewhere different try a different dating site online do something different and that is going to bring in the new to you possibly bring in your your new relationship if you look somewhere different for it okay so that is your reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it remember please to subscribe let's get up to 5,000. let's get rid of the adverts I love you loads. Namaste, blessings and light. Have a brilliant week. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.